Okay, so I wanted to do this video and talk about um, losing weight juicing. And um, I am right now on day 15 of my juice fast. But the difference is, I actually watched this uh, fat sick and nearly dead video, the uh, documentary. Um, how Joe Cross lost, uh, I think, about 100 pounds in 60 days doing juice, juice fast. And right now it's been, that was 2007, right now it's 2011, so it's been uh, about four years now that he's been uh, basically eating well and he's kept that weight off. Um, so the, what is the trick? How, do, how does he do it? Why, why does he continue to stay healthy and not gain all this weight back because I see a lot of people out there on the internet they say that you know a lot of people will lose their weight fast but then they'll just gain all back and then what's more so while having that in my mind uh, it's good to have a plan and uh, so my plan well first of all before I started juicing uh, I went on a just raw food diet for eight days um, and what that did is it basically got all the bad stuff out of my diet so my body was not uh, ingesting or receiving any more toxins or any kind of bad stuff from the, the bad food um, so it was only receiving the good uh, vegetables and fruits and nuts uh, which had good uh, micronutrients and then that, that basically help the body fight all the toxins and, and get all the bad stuff out of it. Uh, because I did the raw diet, it was introducing these micronutrients and all the, the good things in my body in the levels that uh, my body itself could handle all this, this dead toxic stuff that needed to be gotten rid of. And so it was, my, I didn't feel bad. Uh, while it was doing that. Basically, I didn't have any kind of really sick days uh, like they talk about. So it was actually pretty nice. Uh, I did have a couple of, you know, a little bit, I think I had a headache one day, but it was very mellow. Uh, so over these eight days, my body got rid of all the toxins. And also what happened was I got unaddicted from all the starches and, and sugar and all the stuff that I was addicted to. So I was able to just ignore it. I no longer needed it during the day. Uh, so this this eight day or it, it could be five days, ten days, whatever of the raw diet is 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 very good to have success with this juicing because it will it will get your body ready for it. So you don't have really hard time uh, going through detoxification uh, that will you know make you feel really horrible. So um, now my plan is to do this uh, juice fast until I lose all my weight to a uh, healthy level. Uh, my goal is going to, my minimum goal is to go to down to 220 uh, by my body weight or by my uh, height. I should be about uh, 210. That's my normal weight. Uh, that I'm supposed to be. So I'm gonna to go to 220, that's my first goal. After that, I wanna go down to 200. And uh, ultimately, I would like to be under 200. Um, after this juice fast, what I wanna do is I'm going to go back on the raw diet for about 10 days to get the food back, introduced back into my, uh, into my uh, body. And then after that, uh, my, uh, plan is to basically have juice in the morning and then raw food for lunch and then regular dinner um, obviously with healthy choices in mind for dinner but I really feel I can do this and I don't see any reason why I wouldn't be able to uh, you know once you reach this goal you know once I reach this goal weight it's going to be very uh, inspiring for me to continue to keep that weight 
and not let it, you know, get back up there. So that's my plan, and I, I believe that it will work. I am determined to lose this weight, unlike any other diet. This the reason this juicing helps is because it gets rid of the fat or the weight so fast uh, that you can just look forward and see the pounds falling off, and that encourages you more to stay on it and keep with it. Once you lose it all, it's a lot easier to maintain it rather than uh, have to lose, you know, on any other diet, you just have to lose one pound, three pounds, you know, all a week, a month, whatever. It just takes forever, so you just live there on, you know, boiled chicken or whatever, uh, whatever else people choose to eat uh, on their diets. You know, counting points and having to not eat here and there, and it's like you're continuing to live your normal life, but you're you're limiting yourself, you can't have this, you can't have that. Uh, it's a horrible way to live, you know, while you're not encouraged by anything. Because, uh, you, you know, you lose one pound, two pounds, you still see yourself as fat in the mirror, and there's nothing to keep you going. But once you lose all this fat, and you see your brand new person in the, in the mirror, that's what keeps you going. That's what's going to continue to keep doing what you need to do. Uh, so one of the other things while I'm doing the juicing is sometimes I do have, you know, these times when I need to, when I really feel like I can't go on, like this is forever, this is going to take so, so long to reach. Uh, I have to think on the goal, you know, I have to think about what I'm going to look like when I do lose all this weight. Um, I go out and look at before and after pictures of people that have lost weight. You know, these are amazing stories of people that, that were, you know, 300 pounds or whatever, and they lost uh, a bunch of uh, weight and got down to their, you know, healthy level, uh, good weight. It's just amazing to see that transformation. Uh, and that just, it inspires me, and I think that anybody else out there would also see that as beneficial. Uh, and then also, you know, I haven't been able to buy any normal clothes in regular stores uh, simply because, you know, 3X sizes of shirts just don't, they just don't sell them in normal stores. You know, you have to either special order or go to, you know, uh, special stores that sell extra large or, or 3X size clothes. So it's been hard for me to just go and buy normal clothes that people wear. Uh, so I actually went out and looked and went to American Eagle and looked at some clothes that I'm, I want to be able to buy in the normal sizes. So that's also another inspiration for me. And I think that will also help anybody else out there that wants to go out and, and basically, you know, figure out what your goal is. What do you want to do once you do lose this weight? Losing weight is not really a goal. The goal is what are you going to do with it? Once you have it, what are the reasons? Like I want to, I want to learn to not learn. I want to run. That's one of my uh, things. Is I want to be able to jog, you know, five seven miles without, you know, just dying. So uh, that's one other goal that I have. So having these goals is what keeps me going. Uh, anyway, that's all I have to say. And uh, let's see. Oh yeah. Uh, go to my blog and watch my progress at uh, geekgrass.com. That's G E E G E E K G R A S S dot com. Geek Grass. I'm a computer geek and I'm you know overweight, so I just got this domain geekgrass.com because I'm, I'm you know eating juice and grass right now. So uh, anyway. Go to my blog and, you know, post me some comments. Encourage me. I'm going to need encouragement. I like it when people, you know, look at my progress and just help me to keep going because, you know, this is a hard uh, road and it's nice when people encourage you and help you keep going. Um, that will be it. Thank you for watching this video.